Hey everybody, Sam back once again, and it's time for another cool review for you. This time we are going to be reviewing the Anchor Extended Battery for the Samsung Galaxy S3. So, let's have a quick look at it first of all. Let's have a look at the packaging. I just want to say a big massive thank you to the awesome people at Anchor for getting in touch with me to send this out to me for the review. So as you can see there, it is for the Galaxy S3. When I say extended, it's not got a massive extension. It's only a 2200 milliamp, but that is 100 milliamp bigger than the official one that comes with the Galaxy S3 automatically. As you can see there, high capacity and you get a nice 12 month warranty. And let's have a quick look on the back of it as well. As you can see, long lasting capacitor. If you want to screenshot that there, then you can do. And we'll come away from it. But yeah, basically they got in touch with me, which what are my opinion on this one. Um, didn't ask for a review, but I feel it actually deserves a review in the end of it, to be fair. So let's take it out of the packaging. Just pop that off to one side really quickly. So here it is. And as you can see here, it is well, a bit of a different look than the normal battery you normally get. It's got the cool Anchor logo on there. I believe I'm seeing Anchor right. It may be wrong, but that's how I'm going to be saying it. Galaxy S3. Got your Vulture, you need 2200 milliamp powers. On the back of it. You can see it there. So... This is the only packaging it really comes with. It does come with like a little kind of instruction guide manual, but let's be honest, it's a battery. It's not like a hard to actually use. So what I'm going to do today is just show you the, the difference between the official one that comes with the phone and then the anchor one. Now, as I say, the actual price of this, um, remarkably, is only £7.99. So in terms of, let's say, US money, we're talking about about 11 to $12. In Euros, probably about €9. Euros maybe nine and a half to ten euros again depending on the exchange rate you're talking under ten euros and about twelve dollars maximum which got to be honest with you i've always been wary of cheap batteries because the official ones they're normally that price for a reason same with other manufacturers you know they're normally a higher price for a reason but anyway it's going to show you actually the back cushion really quickly let's turn that over so as you can see they are both identical in terms of size turn it over you can see there there's no difference at pretty much at all obviously like in the look whatever that is there but in terms of the overall size of them they're identical in size and this kind of you know i'm thinking oh okay this is gonna be pretty cool it's just gonna fit in the phone as of normal which exact exactly what we're looking for so again 2100 milliamp 2200 identical size though so you've got a slight advantage in terms of actual the number on this one so stick it into the device so relatively straightforward stick it in and just to prove that yes it's not bigger at all it fits in perfect and just to prove even more put the back on there as well and there we go it's on the device not any kind of hump or like that it fits in your standard phone so if you don't want a, an extended if you want a bit of a slight extension or just a spare battery but you don't want to make your phone any built bulkier then this could be a perfect option for you so we'll turn it on um, not really going to show anything on the phone because it's just a battery <laughs> not much you can really show in the phone itself now, obviously, you want to know, does how does it perform to the original one? Well, got to be honest with you, it's pretty much identical in terms of performance. I didn't really notice any kind of difference at all, uh, which, to be fair, I'm actually kind of impressed with. Again, for the price of it, you're talking £8, €10, Euros, $12. Again, depending on the exchange rates, I expect it to probably underperform, you know, due, due to actual price. I thought uh, it might not have the actual, you know, it might not have the capacity they say they do. But to be fair to the anchor and to be fair to the, you know, the actual battery itself, it performed just as well as the official battery. So I've got the exact same amount of you know, talk time and my kind of browsing time. So don't expect it to be, you know, to offer you anything extra or anything less. It pretty much gives you the same performance, but for a very, very bargain price. Now, if you're one of those people that are thinking, I want to keep my phone nice and slim, but I don't mind carrying a spare battery with me to switch out, this could be a perfect option for you because you get the whole thinness of the phone, but at the same time, you get an extra battery for, for the price it actually is. So I can definitely recommend it. I'm going to put a link in the description if you want to go pick one of these up. And again, for the price, you can't go wrong. A big massive props to the people over at Anchor for getting this to me for the review. I've been very impressed with it. And again, I've not noticed any difference. The one thing you're probably thinking, Sam, obviously Samsung put the NFC chips inside the battery. Will it still have NFC? Unfortunately not, no. Obviously due to the price of it, they couldn't really afford to put an NFC chip in there as well. So if you are one of those people that uses NFC on a regular basis, unfortunately this won't work. So your NFC will actually die. It will no longer work on the actual phone itself. Maybe in the future they may bring one with an NFC chip to be a bit more expensive. But at the moment, for £8, 
I'm not complaining. I don't use NFC that a lot at all, pretty much anywhere. Anyway, people, again, much props to Anchor for this one. If you've got any questions about you know what to do by now, hit them up down below. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter, at Sam J. Pullum. And yeah, you'll see me all in my next video. Cheers, everyone.